Hey, what is up guys? A new tag begins here. And in this video, we're gonna uh, go ahead and have a look at the CMOS date and time not set message, which I had today when I turned on my computer. This is not a fatal uh, message or fatal error. It just means that your date and time is not set. And the first thing you will want to try to do is to enter the BIOS setup and set your date and time. And if for some reason you still get the error of uh, CMOS date time not set, then most probably it will mean that your CMOS battery is uh, empty and that you need replace to replace it with a new battery so first we try to put in the correct date let's try to put the, co the correct time uh, is it and then here like 41 Apply, OK, and then save and exit, F10, enter. Probably it will just now reboot just fine, because the uh, computer has not been turned off yet. If I turn it off, if I just turn it off, and I'll wait a few seconds, and then turn it back on. Let's see if we get the same errors, messages. Okay, now, if you get the same message, then what you want to do is to go ahead and grab one of these batteries and swap them, and swap the battery on your motherboard. This is the CR2032 uh, It's a 3 volt uh, battery 3 volt battery and um, It's the DL2032 ECR2032 or compatible GPCR2032 This comes in a handy 5-pack uh, and uh, without further ado, I will now use the unbox one. And let's try to open it up. Here it is. Okay, so you want to go ahead and locate the place where the battery is located. And in this case it's right here as you can see i'm using this tool to uh, to remove the battery just bear with me one second i will try to remove it just by clicking the lever in a way that it can come off just like that there it is here we have the the battery which is most probably uh, drained so if i have a look at the date of this battery this battery is from doesn't mention it which date it is but anyways i will try to put a new one i will try to put a new one let's see what will happen Here's the new one, and let's go ahead and let's insert it into place. It should click in just like that, very easy. There you go. 
can use this plastic tool to press it a little bit not too not too much just to be sure that it is located in his place and yeah that's basically it so now we are going to restart the computer and see what happens all right so let's turn on the computer and see now what will happen yeah that's good that looks good if I go into the BIOS setup by pressing the Dell key or the uh, you see you see I don't know if you can see it but still have the correct date and time okay well uh, that concludes this video for today so today you saw how we can swap the CR32 uh, sorry the CR2032 CMOS battery and then um, uh, you probably will have to swap it once in five years sometimes it will uh, it will take even longer the battery if it's a good battery depends how much you use your computer also and uh, in a and once in a while you just have to swap the CMOS battery if you have error like um, CMOS date and time not set then you just swap it you will be good to go I hope this video was helpful for you if it was hit that like button don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in my next video stay well and adios